Hi, this is Melini. Today I'm going to talk to you about epithelums and hyloceras. First, we'll talk about the epithelums. These are known as epithelum hybrid. This is known as a prima ballerina and has bright pink flowers. Now, epithelums are from Mexico and Central America, and they have stunning flowers that range in many different colors, such as what you see here, bright pink. Um, this one has orange. And then you see this one has known as Emmett Kelly. So we wrote that down in the pot and you can Google search that name and find the color of the flower. Now, epiphones are known as epicacti or orchid cacti. And the flowers appear at the edges of the stem. And you see here, the stems are just flat, green, leafless stems. And they do best, as you see here, in a hanging container. And you need a hanging container so that you can see it draped down very nicely at the edge of the pot. Now, epiphyllums thrive best in shade or filtered sunlight, water once a week, and they're not frost hardy. Now, let's talk about hyloceras. These are also known as um, fuchsia dragon fruit and they're from the tropical rainforest of Central and Northern Southern America. Now they have slightly larger fragrant white flowers than epithelums. Their flowers are slightly fragrant and they're mainly white. Um, they're known as um, epiphytic cacti and they have um, large edible um, fuchsia-like red fruits, also known as dragon fruits. And that appears after the flower blooms. Now, um, the hyloceras or epiphytic cacti, they receive most of their moisture through um, aerial roots. And those roots are easily attached to trees in nature. A shade or filter light is best. Water once a week and they're not frost hardy. They thrive best between 65 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit. Thank you for watching.